What is going on, everybody? Draco Invictus here, and I'm still getting shit set up, so don't mind me. Man, my battery's already at 15%. Shit. Hey, everybody. Draco Invictus here, and we are doing a Friday night live stream of The Witcher 3. How is everybody? God, it's been forever, it feels like. I'm waiting for the software to finish on my phone, so bear with me. Hey, Jerome, Mikey, Vault Girl, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. And I love reading all the uh, the conversations you guys were having on Discord while I was gone. That's awesome. I'm just trying to get my, my software running on my phone so that I get this thing all controlled. That turned around. There we go. Oh. Let's see. Remote. And uh, there we go. We got it. All right. So we are. No, I don't want you right now. Go away. Welcome back, everybody. It's been what a week and a half. Shit, it's been forever since I talked to you guys. I hope you guys have uh, had a good week. Uh, I had a wonderful vacation. I'm sure I will talk to you more about that uh, as the night progresses. So let's uh, get comfortable. And we are here. Um, we're back at, uh, what is it, Crow's Nest. What's up, Scum? Crow's Perch. <clears throat> That's the idea, Jerome. I'm not, I'm not giving up on uh, modding Fallout 4 yet. Simply because I know that we won't have mods for 76 for quite some time, so. Alright, so we need to head to these three locations up here back in, in the... In the square, as it were, so. You have a list, good. Send it to me on Discord, Mikey. Check our inventory real quick. 35 of 150. All right, lots of room. All right. So let's get on. You're not Roach. Oh, there you are. Hey, buddy. That's it, Roach. Yes, right right down to the back. fast travel marker and uh, head back to town. Don't you point that crossbow at me unless you intend to use it, mister. Alright. You know, before, I think, yeah, I think Junior is the one that we, the, the current quest that we want to do. So, we'll just go ahead and fast travel here. So I checked again for the Xbox Insiders Hub, and I did not get stress test access for Fallout 76. Not that it really matters anyway. I think that server is going to be shutting down every five or ten minutes, and it's just going to be the same thing over and over and over and over again for several hours. I mean, that's cool that you get to be part of that, but... This is not the the beta by any stretch of the imagination, so. PUBG? No. I thought about playing PUBG like two years ago. Point one. 
Take a gander over here. Alright, let's take a look at our quest log. Yeah, get junior level 12. That is definitely the one that we want to do. Let's double check all of our secondaries. Haunted house. Guess we can do that one. Yeah, I guess we need to clean some of this other stuff up down here. And there's a bunch of shit that we gotta do. And then for Witcher contracts, the swamp thing is, I think, the lowest one that we have. So, yep, we got lots of stuff to do. Ah! We are going to come up here. Oh. Uh. Which marker is closest to me? Oh, I ran past it already. Damn. Come to turn around. Oh, stop. Oh, yes, you're so... Ooh. Come on. Thank you. That's not the one I want to go to. Since we're here. Nope. Not going anywhere in this place. So how's everybody been? Mikey, how you been, buddy? Jerome? Vault Girl? I am going to be watching the... Hey, Chandon. Be watching uh, the um, the podcast uh, tomorrow, I think. Don't be shy now. Looking doesn't cost a thing. There's plenty to behold. This here is a collection of wonders that belong to the Mage Eremas. A once in a lifetime opportunity. How do you get a hold of these? Never heard of a mage willingly parting with his treasures? No one asked Eremas's will. He was burned at the stake a fortnight ago. Strange they didn't burn his stuff with him. Witch hunters let you resell it just like that? Why wouldn't they? These are common goods, some valuable only as collectibles, perhaps. How's Odyssey, Mikey? All right, I get it. These items aren't actually common. Rumor has it, each is an enchanted key. Rumor happened to mention where to find the locks these keys open. Sadly, nice. no. Why, if I knew, you could hardly expect me to sell them. Where did Aramas live? At a lovely residence south of Oxenford. Badly damaged now, as he made the hunters pay dearly for his skin. Show me what you have. Nice. Alright, so we got some stuff over here. What do we got there? Potion of Clearance returns all ability points spent 
to develop abilities to the available pool so you can redistribute them. Nice. Rugged saddlebags. I think that's much better than the ones I have. 70? I don't think I can look at... Yeah, I can't look at what Roach is carrying, so I'll have to come back for those. All right, so the lizard figurine, the jade figurine, the old wine from Toussaint. Those are all quest items, as well as this book over here. The Curious Cases of Virtuous Vega. So I guess we'll buy that. Buy all this crap. Oh, one more. Uses magic to show the number of cards missing from your collection. Yeah, no. Hard pass on that. Yeah, see, I thought so too, Vulgrel. Alright. While I'm here, I might as well get rid of the pig hide and leather pelt and incense. So, Vulgirl, what you been busy with? Building, all right. Where are we building at? God, I collect way too much shit. And never get rid of it. Because it doesn't weigh anything. I'm not really hard up for coin right now, so I'm I'm gonna go ahead and. I mean, not that I need, you know, thirty-five ghouls' blood, but. Farewell, statuette of a man. Wasn't carved, but produced using magic. Ought to ask Triss about it. All right. So we're trying to get to this marker. The rain will cleanse the city streets of filth. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice. You here for a specific reason? 
Got a meeting with Rosa. A fencing lesson. Geralt of Rivia. Yes. Miss Rosa stepped out for a walk. Near Temple Bridge, she said. She asked that you join her. Guess it's gonna be an interesting lesson. Thanks. Actually, let's take a look at that quest. Huh. Level 12. Alright. 358. Come on, Roach. Alright, well, we're waiting for Roach. The rain will cleanse the city streets of filth. Cleanse the city streets of filth. All right, I'm back. There we go. All right. Faster. Cannibal Bar and Grill. Nice. Are you doing all Halloween themed stuff? Awful file. Hmm. Strange. Hey there. Ah! What the hell was he talking about? of some sort. Negotiations with the trade corporation continue. The merchants have agreed to almost all of the emperor's conditions. Outlook positive. Rumors have abound that Radovid has found a way to get his hands on Novograd. The key to Novograd is the eternal fire. Control the hierarch. Control the city. A plan is in the works. Next message. The stash at Crippled Kate's. JPIC! Welcome, my friend. So glad to be home. A virtuous whore. Um... No, can there be such a thing as a virtuous whore? How you been, buddy? Alright. Yeah, we'll visit that quest here in a little bit. Let's continue on to the fencing lessons. I totally squirreled on the main mission, but it's all good. Gotta get them all done anyway, right? Go for a like Pokemon, you gotta collect them all. Uh, Ciao, lady, gonna uh, run you over. I just hung the laundry. What did she just say? Cannot do that here. Can't do that here. Fine. Whatever. Perfect weather to sit by a fire. Over here. Oh, that sucks, JP. And I totally ran past <laughs> my quest marker because I was reading JP. No 
Elf Guardian Regiment always accompany you on your walks? Always. Papa's orders. It's for your protection, Rosa dear. People here hate us. Why? What have I done to them? But enough about that. Soldier, you may leave. But His Excellency Ambassador Baratra said that... And this Excellency is telling you otherwise. Do you not recognize him? This is Geralt of Rivia. The best swordsman the North has ever seen. I'm safe with him. Now march off, quickly. Left, right, left, right. Yeah, I wonder why people hate you. Let's go, Geralt. I've something I wish to show you. We were supposed to train, not go for a walk. I know, Geralt. Now stop harping on about it and let's go. Sure. Ah. You see, I thought that instead of training in a dank old cellar, we'd move around in the open air. A duel on a bridge, like in the novels. Now draw your sword. Only got my steel and silver swords. We should be fighting with practice weapons. We should, but you of all people ought to know. There's much more fun in doing things you shouldn't. Listen, I'd really rather not hurt you. Stop patronizing me, or you'll be the one to get hurt. Ooh. Now on guard. That is my pride. By the way, how'd you get interested in fencing? I was bored. I've no friends here. Papa keeps me on a short lead. It's banquet after banquet after banquet. I detest banquets. <laughs> Fair enough. Boring conversations, terrible food, and weak booze. Exactly. At least with a sword in hand, I can have some fun. You know, blow off steam. No weak booze here. All right, what's next? We should return. Just forgive me, Geralt. I know this might sound awkward, but would you mind turning around for a moment? My corset's shifted. It's pinching me terribly. Um. I can understand a woman wanting to look pretty, but fighting in a corset? It slows you. Rosa? Yeah, that's what I thought. Shit, she ran off. Anything happens to her, Varatra will kill me. Need to find her. Yeah, I was like, we're in a very public Can't be far. place. From now on, assume your every move's observed. Far from home, aren't you, sweetie? And there's no telling if you'll ever get back. She's Ambassador Varatra's daughter. She's got diplomatic immunity. I don't really understand the shite you're saying. Now it's clear you love your black ones. It's no surprise, Lucas. Witches are drawn to monsters just the way things are. But this beastie... Wow, people really are stupid, aren't they? I believe you've offended the young lady. Now apologize as nicely as you can. For forgive me, me lady. I I am sorry. Your turn. Be nice like your friend. Bow low and go be a patriot somewhere else.
All right. Lucas and Kobe. I shall remember those names. And when the Emperor takes Novigrad, I will find them and have them pay. Easy. Didn't hurt you in the end. They raised their hand against me. That's enough to have that hand lopped off. And you wonder why the locals hate Nilfgaard? I thought you were different from other Nordlings. That you understand us, our sense of justice. I see I was wrong. You should go home now. And take the shortest, not the scenic route. I understand. Farewell, Geralt. And good luck on the path. Oh. I guess that's the end of that quest one, huh? There's nothing on that board. Line sack of shit. And those cats sure are pissy. Alright, so actually before we do that, let's come over here, take a look at our quests. And get junior. Of Dairy and Darkness. Oh, that's in Velen. Level 9. We should probably get those out of the way, huh? Yeah, Haunted House, the gangs. We need to get all that lower level shit out of the way. And we're not going to get much XP for them at all. So. Thank you, Volko. As always, you are my best compatriot and companion in these long trips. Always making sure I got my shit on straight. <laughs> yeah, definitely nothing there. It's so a secondary. Is that level 7? That's Novigrad. Yeah, let's go ahead and track that quest. Oh yeah, 30 to 70. Well worth it. Being pushed by a chicken. Okay. To the square. Are you heading home now, JPEG? I'm warning you. You're warning me. So, how do you go with this thing? I was talking about how that works. works. Mug like that won't get you a copper. Gosh, to be elegant, right? Nice. have one without the other then I don't want them no, she is not down here <laughs> up 
stairs. Yep, there we go. Witcher, Witcher. Kareem, look who's come. Huh. Live here together now? Didn't know. Once you told me Sarah had been responsible for my nightmares, I decided to see if the devil's as scary as they paint him, or her. I came in to find not a fiend, but our little Sarah. And I can't say why, but we took a liking to one another immediately. Long ago, to isolate themselves from a world of beasts, humans began building cities. But since beasts prowl within stone walls as well as they do outside them, this did not allay human fears. The truth is, walls guarantee no one's safety. The place where you lock yourself in and lock all else out, that's not your home. Your home is sometimes a place you travel long and far to find. All right. Well, that quest is easily taken care of, huh? the next stash using your witcher senses. Rock on. <laughs> ah! What the? Did he trip down the stairs? That's funny. Oh, no. Oh. <clears throat> Alright, let's try this again. There we go. How far are we going? 135. That boy is a running full. Watch it, Trad. No regrets, not your stomping bread. No bread, no coin, or a shite. Oh. Cut me. What is it, Grey Boy? Looking for adventure? Hmm. I think I can move this. The Trade Corporation is haggling about the price of its support for the Emperor. The merchants want more influence in the East and South. Unsure how that will end. We know. Hemel farts weakness. You get our girl into the Begel Buds bash. I'll put the kit and the coin in the stash in the Gildorf sewers. Here's the key. Take the loot from the spy's chest. Ah! Oi, fucker! Did he just say, I fucker? That's kind of rude. What's he doing here? Whatever the hell I want. And down we go. Seems the exchange is going to be unsuccessful. The Trade Corporation has broken off negotiations. Inform the Emperor immediately. He cannot count on its support. 
Operation Hemelfart remains unchanged. All good to go on our side. Your girl better not let us down. Given the merchant's treachery, the outcome of the war might depend on it. Alright. Yeah, experience point one. I know, I'm a fart. Man, it seems to me there would be a lot of exploring to do down here in the, uh, in the sewers as well. Yes, Hemelfart. Talk to Cleaver. Honor among thieves. So I guess we'll do this one. And it's way the hell down there. So. How about that one? Is it closer? It is. All right. Better put them both on me. <laughs> oh, since we're here, how can it's I a be proper sense? name, even? Got some coin I'd like to convert into crowns. You've come to the right place. 24. All right. That's true. Very true, Mikey. Ah, an apple a day. An apple a day will not be good for your diabetes. I think I pissed me trousers, he said. Just look at the freak. This is definitely the right place. Me! 
Definitely not going in that way. You look familiar. Is it not uncomfortable? All that steel on your back. How in the hell? No. Why? I don't even let you take a goat. Yeah, Are you. Will you want any prize? <laughs> Awful pale. Here we go. A wee minute, Witcher. Now, I'm curious something mighty. How is it you were off the same bloody night horse and tried to kill me? Twas chance, honest. I was at the brothel. I've witnesses. I don't doubt you found some witnesses, but I do doubt the bit about chance. Know what? Shite conversation this. So much blethering, we've got nowhere. Lad, you have a chat with him. It's simple. I want to know where all son is. I've not betrayed you. Not ever. No oh, shit. No. No, I know nothing. Hmm. Pissed off dwarves. Not a good idea. Help me find Junior. I'm about to send my lads around Horson's hideouts. Won't say no to a witch's blade. Leave my men, take the water Junior, and drag him out of his hidey hole. Win win situation, as I see it. Orson can't die until I've talked to him. My lads are hot-headed and I like him like that. Want to rein them in? Do so on your own. Hmm. Not interested in your squabbles. Figure out what you want. Come and see me. Well, I guess, since that is still a thing to do, looks like we are taking him up on his offer. Might as well, right? Those out of the way. Cow's milk. Change of heart. With or without you, I will hang horse sun stones out to dry. Joining forces just seems reasonable. All right. Now, I suspect Junior's hiding at his casino in Gildorf. Either that or near the arena beneath the bits. My lads will be there. Find him. Naomi, welcome to the stream. Oi, Coca. My 
might as well get that done, huh? Oh, cannot save the game right now. Fair enough. Life, you gotta take risks and not get back. I have been good. Had a great vacation. Right, Ate way too right. much food. But I damn near paid for the whole thing in about 10 hours. So. And had a blast doing it. It was definitely the best kind of vacation, that's for sure. Cleaver send you? Aye, he did. Awaiting your word. Let's go. Time's a wasting. You heard them. We're going in. It's not wrong at all. All right, Naomi. Thanks for coming by.
Igor's key. Message from Igor. Since there's been some misunderstanding lately about the valuables and a bit of bloods have been spilt for no plowing reason whatsoever, I'd like to reassure you all the coin is safe and sound in the lockbox. The blind arsehole who thought it was missing was looking in the wrong place. Walk down the corridor leading from the upper level towards the arena. Turn so your backs to the grating and look to the wall opposite you. If you've eyes to see, you'll find what you're looking for. Let me emphasize that Horson Jr.'s crowns have not been touched, not a single copper's missing. I swear on my own handsome head that they're secure and waiting to be picked up. Alright. Oops, wrong button. So the one that I'm facing is... worn by a moving door something behind this wall Horson Jr., King Radovid is unhappy with your performance. You were to rid the city of the other members of the so-called Big Four. And not only do they still live, but they also now know of your role in their attempted assassination. This was not our arrangement. For the time being, hide in the place which the messenger delivering this missive will indicate to you and stay out of sight. His Majesty lives in the hope that mutual animosity between the other members of the Big Four will finish the job which you attempted, yet flubbed so badly. And Ooh. And All right. So now we got to go talk to Dykstra about Horson's ties to the Redeemer. Nothing left down here. That's not a gate. That's not him. This is him. Why would he die? 
you have no real interest in fighting me. I don't know. Nope. Alright, Really? Screaming, screaming, Oh, nice. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, shit. Alright, so much for that, huh? You know, there was an update for the uh, Streamlabs OBS, but I still don't think that the monitoring is working. I'm not hearing anything, so... It's kind of a bummer. Yeah, that, yes, that is really this guy's name. Horson Jr. Yeah, I'd rather take, what was it, Heppelfart or Heppelfart or whatever it was. Whereas Mikey said, like, blurt queef. Yeah, they definitely had fun with names around here. Oh shit, I gotta do that whole thing again? What? Hmm. Oh. Where's the key? Read the note real quick. We can't get down in there, so... Put your sword away. This we know exactly where to go, right? Floor is worn by a moving door. Something behind this wall. Imagine uh, the uh, parent-teacher conferences would definitely be difficult. Yeah, you you either got your ass kicked a lot or kicked a lot of ass. Oh, no. 
I'm just going to ignore that fight this time. Since we know we can't do anything about it. Oh! Sorry. See, it says that it's down. So I was thinking we need to come under this little bridge thing here, but we're not going to jump off from the high point this time. Ah! Sorry. Got a minute? I do. What do you want? Wiley, Horson Jr. He's working with Radovid. Huh? If this is reliable information, Horson's neck deep in shit. You fallen out with Redania? My sympathies have nothing to do with this. Horson wiped his ass with our agreement. That's betrayal, regardless of his current allegiance. Need someone who can get me in to see Jr. You must still have some contacts among the Redanians? I don't, but you do. Enlighten me. Temerian, former commander of the Blue Stripes. Ring a bell? Vernon Roach. He's holed up with his men in a camp near Oxenford. Pay him a visit. You're sure to cheer him up at least. All right. Yeah, there are quite a few people with very interesting names. Alright, now where are we going? It all points to the same location. Oh no. I gotta go all the way out there? Shit. I guess we could go to the Vegelbud residence. And then venture down that way. And our clearest... Nearest marker is actually oh, okay. Right at the bridge. Bud Residence. <whistles> Roach, that was very weird. So JPEG, how are you like an Odyssey, man? Looking for Roach. Cool. No one here by that name. Anything else? I see. And behind you, that's a berry picker's camp? We're, uh, 
Bird watches. Bird Let watches. me guess. That sword's in case you run into a hornbill. No. Hornbills aren't endemic to this area. Don't migrate here either. You blind, Hortensio. That's Geralt, old friend of mine. Come in, Geralt. That's cool. Geralt of Rivia. Safe and sound. Vernon Roach. Tamaria's last hope. Laugh all you want. Tamaria will rise again. Wow. Right, you That's crazy, cannot Jacob. abandon them. You can and must, because those are your orders. They'll die, please. We're done. Dismissed. How do you wind up here? Came with the army, of course. It's remnants. When Nilfgaard crossed the Yaruga, I dropped everything. Threw it all away to hell and rode for the front to fight the invader. Joined the Second Temerian Army under John Natalis. We were to stop the Black One's advance along the dull Blathana Mount Carbon line. And we did. For three days. Then they smashed us into splinters. Soon after, I heard Radovid was assembling his forces near Novigrad. That he'd promised to fight for a free north. Broke through with the remains of Natalis's army, but... But? But Radovid proved no better than Amir. So I decided I would mount my own fight. What do you do here? Hunt Scoyatel? You jest, right? Who cares about the Scoyatel anymore? Temeria. That's what matters. Looking for Horson Jr. I've heard of him. Though I'm not sure why you think he might be in my camp. Heard some birds chirping. You've got some of the same friends. Both seem to count Radovid among your allies. These birds. They're terribly talkative. I'll need to see them. You'll have to point them out. Mm hmm Meantime, Vernon, willing to help or do I need to keep looking? Mm. As always, you've more luck than you deserve. I'm on my way to meet my Redanian contact. We're meeting near Oxenfurt at a chess club. Thanks. Knew I could count on you. A chess club, yes. <clears throat> Where I always meet people. Chess club. You and our commander. What the blade is you thinking? Run, Roach. You cannot do that here. My contact should be slow now. His last Ready? Ones are My contact awaits at the chess club. Let's get this over with. Your contact. Who is it? Slippery little bugger. I'd have nothing to do with him. Were the circumstances any different? You mean you don't trust him? I trust no one, including you. Come on. That's okay. That that may be fair.
Something's not right. Yeah, that guy has no neck. Let's Gwent? see what. It's a card game. It's um. There are a lot of games that are very similar. Yeah, you have a deck. There's three different. There's three different rows. There is an infantry, an archery, and then a siege row. And the cards in your deck can play into one of those three rows. Or they may affect a row. Yes, they are. JPEG. And they actually have an actual card game called Gwent. So... I haven't done anything for building my deck in this playthrough, so they say it's the game. I get of my kings. ass handed to me. That chess teaches one to think strategically. What a load of rubbish! Both sides have identical pieces. The rules stay invariably the same. How does this mirror real life? Witcher, do you know why I play chess? I have no idea. I play chess to reveal the game's secret. Blood thumps inside these chessmen. You need only listen, and you will hear. This is fucked up dup chess dup. pieces. Dub dub, dub dub. A heart pumping with life. <laughs> I take a pawn, and I hear flesh being rent. I win a piece, and I hear screams from the depths of its bowels. I want to break the chessmen open. Squeeze the truth from them. Do you see what I mean? Uh... Sure. Yes, sire. Believe I do. You know shit. You're merely humoring me. I was not speaking literally. First hidden truth. A monarch is always surrounded by fools. Understand? Yeah, that's very true there, JPEG. Nope, still don't get it. Unimportant. Let us speak. Why have you brought the Witcher here? I think he'd best explain. Expected a Redanian spy. Had no idea we'd be meeting a king. When you've an opportunity to omit intermediaries, I'd suggest you avail yourself of it. I'm looking for Cyprian Wiley, Orson Jr. I know Redania supports him. Why do you seek him? It's personal. Fair enough. I'll not pry. I have placed Junior in a mansion in Oxenfurt. Very few know this. They'll not let you in unannounced. Thus, you must tell them you've come about the new whores. Junior constantly requests fresh women. I hear he doesn't treat them well. You just give me a man after investing coin and time in him? Can't help but wonder why. Consider it a gesture of goodwill. Almost. I'll expect you to return the favor. And also, Junior has lost his purpose. The Big Four is no more. I shall contact you to collect in due course. Now go. And you, Roach. We must speak another time. How do you know he's king? He's ain't got shite all over him. Radovid's sinking ever deeper into madness as I see it. I know where to find Junior. Don't really care beyond that. Geralt, come to think of it, I too wanted to ask a favor. I have a terrible problem with Bess. Need someone to talk some sense into her. Come see me at the camp. I'll tell you more. Let me think about it. See you, Roach. 
See a roach. That's it. You better put that pig sticker away. for an eye of dairy and darkness that and honor among thieves that's just the turn in there so I guess we will go do of dairy and darkness gotta get all this low level shit out of the way yeah Let's see if we can find a close marker Western Gate seems to be the closest one. I failed the gangs. Oh, that sucks. Kill your motherland's enemies. Die for your motherland. And soak in the fucking rain for your motherland. Tell me that's going to stop the gate. Right, boy. Calm down. <laughs> oh look, there's one. Hey there. Okay, so apparently we don't have to go that far. Just across the bridge. This way? Yep. Come on. You cannot do that here. Still right. Alright, JPEG, have a great night, buddy. Thank you for coming in the map, as always. I appreciate it. Wonder what this means. Interesting. Alright. Hunters have stalked my house for days. I knew they'd come eventually, of course, the that pugnant Limburger's vision was all clear, but I must risk it and stay a few more days. 
The cheeses have entered an intensely fascinating stage of maturity and transporting them is entirely out of the question. I've worked on this recipe for 40 years and I would rather die than abandon it now. In the event that I'm unable to divine the time and nature of the hunter's attack, I bequeath my most valuable treasure to whoever brave adventurer will be able to find it. May this reward inspire them to continue my work and stand on the shoulders of the giants of Tyromancy. Joffrey Munster, Alvin Malone, and last but not least, the Baron of Blue, Paradise Stick. What is Phoenix in saying? Why won't it let you be in stress? She needs to come like talk. This guy was died over cheese. He died for cheese. House is completely destroyed, but the magic circle's intact. Looks to me like a locked portal. Wonder if I can open it using one of Aramis's items. And away we go. Oh, wow. Shit, that was fast. <sighs> Reeks in here. Of that cheese. stench. Ripe cheese. Seems Aramis was a tyromancer. So it was cheese. cheese out of necker milk need to be careful that's disgusting She is Miss America. Hi, Phoenix. I don't even know what the hell I'm looking for down here. Thanks. It's nice to be back. Mega hugs for sure. Jesus. 
Jesus. Vesemir will get a kick out of this when I tell him. Not sure this can get any worse. Oh, I'm sure it can. Why'd you have to say that, girl? That's really good. Ah. I don't know why he does that. It freaks me out. Fucking light it already. This is a bitch to swim in. Cannot do that. We have to keep swimming. Yeah, but most beans are, are high in carbs, too, Denise. That's typically what you're going to get out of it. What the fuck? Of course, there's something moving around over there. Gotta share this discovery with Lambert. Fuckets are immune to the smell of the Figurine and Aramis's notes. The vision stabilized, and lo and behold, I saw as if through a moonlit haze the four prin haze, the four princes, each clad in armor and astride a horse. The first rode a steed the color of fog, the second of sulfur, the third black as the abyss, and the fourth a pony. A pony! And then I beheld a fountain, a clear spring, but the princes did not drink of it, for it was forbidden. Ooh. And then a bird of paradise, shining in ruby and gold, flew above them, and alit upon the branch of a tree. And the tree had arms numbering a thousand and forty. He counted each one. Draw from the source, said the bird, but they pointed to the sun's bloody tears and did not draw. Then a pure virgin appeared with bared breast, ooh, exposing her modest bosoms, ruddy and firm like ripe linden berries. Berries? To, uh, 
I think she might take offense at that, maybe. I don't know. Then my nose became accustomed to the aroma and the vision passed. Tomorrow I shall try to unseal the well-aged sample from Geno. My vort is said to have a refined, deep scent with slightly nutty aftertaste. Well, we shall see. And a smoking pipe. Some great stuff to sell. And lots of cheese. Some kind of vault. I should look around. Magic barrier still active. Gotta find a way to turn it off. Hey, Cray Bros. Nahalani's eye. Gotta use it. as deadly as Aramas's cheeses. It's worth taking. Maybe I'll name it the Emmentaler. The Emmentaler. All right. We've acquired the Emmentaler. Now we need to get the hell out of here. Probably up this way. Yep. Before we go walking through that, let's make sure we got everything. She blows. So, Miss Denise, how you been? What you been up to? What you working on? So, let us, I'm sure it's probably crap by this point, but let's take a look at it anyway. Looks like we will be selling the Emmentaler, I'm thinking. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. What else we got over here? Garbage, garbage. How about this one? That's because I haven't done one in a long time. Great. So I get plus 10% Axie, plus 4% chance to dismember. And no. Hard pass. Alright, let's take a look at the clothing that we've acquired. No. No. Not that I would wear any of those anyway. But... All right, and we're at 72 of 190. Man, that's nice. Yeah, 
Is it the griffin or is it the uh, the other one? Because I picked up one piece of or one upgrade thing um, up top. Yeah, I think it is the cat. Yes, it was the feline stuff. I picked that up at the top of the little tower there. Sad you can't look at that stuff. Ah, yes, but I do see the cave. Oh, get a nice little contact eye, huh? How nice of them. Oh, so I do have to come back over here, Bulk Girl? Okay. Yeah, I don't care for the smell either, Phoenix. I have a friend that she has... Like, she didn't know until after she started smoking weed that she has, like, a severe problem with it. Winds howling. Like, it triggered, like, we'll her bipolar. You know, I was like, oh my god, you poor thing. Any need, ah. monster? But she's doing much better. <laughs>
Open up. That's funny. The door just flies open. should pick your Mark. men more carefully. Rico blew his cover like a novice. Yeah, he told me. You're gonna go watch Venom? I told him to Please leave tell me town. you're gonna go watch Most Venom. Most likely promised I'd reward you, didn't he? So he said. Take it. Take it. I think I'm gonna go see it tomorrow. Thanks for coming by, buddy. Imagine that sword's pretty crap, too. Hmm. Not by comparison, though. God, look at everything that oh, that's what I'm just doing. I mean, the base damage is better, but everything else. How you been, Mark? You been staying out of trouble? Or causing? No, nah, causing it. I don't even know why I fucking asked. Oh, nice. Pam, 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 Pam. Mm -hmm. What are you offering? Not much. At all. Thinking about going to see Venom tomorrow. I think that'll be fun. Those are new. The racing horse blinders. I'll have to put those on the roach. These saddlebags I can sell. And he ain't gonna give me shit for any of this. Yeah, I hear you, Mark. <clears throat> Yeah, you know the problem with living out in the woods in a little log cabin, Phoenix? No internet. <laughs> and satellite internet is just garbage when it comes to doing anything significant online. Well, I've just been so busy with everything, I didn't even realize that it actually opened this weekend, so. Yeah, I used to install the satellite internet. Data caps and slowdowns, oh, hell no. Hell, that was a requirement when I was buying my house a few years ago. It had to have decent internet. Now, when I say decent, I mean decent for here. Yeah, 
It was 24-4, and I was like, yes. I'm 110, and I'm stoked. Imagine if I lived in a major metro area where I could get, like, 100-plus up and down. Ah. Oh. See you. And it's really pricey. Well, it used to be pricey. Is it still pricey, Mark? For like huge. Th That's the big one. Alright, quests. Skip that for now. <gasps> Let's see an eye for an eye. Meet Roach at his camp. Following the thread. Nice. All right, that's even better. I mean, when it's that or nothing, then okay, sure. But my old, old, old boss, he actually tried running a business off of it. I was like, oh, that's going to hurt. But he was running a business out of his, out of essentially his backyard. He had put up a, a trailer for the, the office for the girls and... Uh, and he was living out in the middle of nowhere, so. Go to Pharaoh and look. Oh, I can't go to. Can I go to Pharaoh? Here? I don't think that I can. Nope. Because that's in the skeleton. And Denise, I don't know why, the only thing I have is a Minecraft beta. That's the only, like, game thing that I can do on the Insider. And I imagine you're not going to actually get to play a whole lot. It's going to be a lot of server up and down. Alright, so we're not doing that quest. Yet, anyway... So, eye for an eye. No, I pre-ordered, but I pre-ordered from GameStop. But, like I said, if, uh, if you were out in the middle of nowhere and that is all you have, then it's better than nothing. I hear you. Guys, one shady individual. Temple guard lets you into the city. One another dove in blood. It's clear as the eternal fire. Oh, I've had enough of living.
it true you kill kings? You and our commander. Slash right, slash left. Slash the left guard. Jesus. When this is all over, I aim to open a whorehouse in Vizima. A problem. With shaggy rugs on the wall. Hi, Kate. Foul smelling candles everywhere. Hmm. All right. What kind of contribution? Go enjoy the have? film. Well, just manpower. Or Thanks, Mark. Power, Appreciate it, buddy. Maybe. Geralt of Rivia, safe and sound. Mentioned you have a problem. Mm hmm. It's Vess. She took a couple of lads across the river. She plans to hit the black ones at Mulberdale. So, sounds about like what guerrilla fighters do. Yes. When they're ordered to. Whereas I forbade her from leaving camp. Indefinitely. Don't trust Vess anymore? Bollocks. She's prepared to die for me. Ah, oh, that's not the problem. Know what distinguishes a soldier from a common swashbuckler? The uniform. It's a serious question. A rhetorical one. So Could instead be. of waiting for an answer, just enlighten me. Soldiers think tactically. They know when to strike, when to fall back, when to charge and when to hold. Vess finds this difficult. Yeah, I hear She's you. She's impulsive, hot-headed. Yet in guerrilla warfare, one false step and you're fucked. I confined her to the camp because I feared that sent out, she'd go rabid and make a mistake. I was right. Why Mulberrydale? Why'd Vess go there? The peasants from the village aided us earlier. The Nilfgaardians learned of this. Word got out they're planning a punitive expedition. Probably hang every fifth villager. Hmm. Honestly, Vess's desire to save the villagers makes sense. What doesn't is your opposition to the plan. War means death. Not only for the soldiers, for the common folk as well. You can't save them all, it's that simple. Funny. Had you for an idealist. You were right to. Are right to. But I have one ideal. A free Temeria. And I'm prepared to sacrifice anything for it. No, they probably didn't know. They probably said, you know what? We, we need to ramp this up. We need to start testing the servers now. Before we're at, like, launch ready. Because that's essentially when the beta hits... That game is pretty much going to be launch ready, which is why they're not going to be doing a server wipe once the beta hits. So, all right. But they will so be doing the server wipe for the stress testing. What am I supposed to do about it? I doubt Vess has entered the village. More likely, she and the boys lie in wait in the woods. Yeah, exactly. We must find her before she attacks and stop her. You're a good tracker. Help me. Count me in. Thanks, Geralt. I'll owe you a favor. Meet me in Velen beneath the Hanged Man's Tree. It's just a short jaunt from there to Mulberry Dale. Is there a mulberry bush? We'll pay you for big trouble, Greylocks. Just now, witches. Witches. They can't catch the fox. Yeah, but it would have been nice to know. I mean, I certainly have no aversion to to order. I should have just ordered it off of the fucking Xbox and just been done with it. But I happened to be like right next door to the GameStop, and I was like, "Oh, I need to order that." So it is what it is. Now, honestly, how is that skeleton still hanging up there? That's funny. Ooh. 
Ooh, I have a new Gwent card. It's the village below. Black with Nilf guardians already. They're preparing to execute folk. No sign of this. Uh, she may be impetuous, but she's not stupid. She's waiting for her moment. Probably attack after dusk once. Shh. What now? A trio, lightly equipped, sneaking closer. Over there, near the. Death to the black ones! Epne! Circa! Looks like we're too late. Geralt, we have to help. Follow me. He heard that from all the way the fuck over there. Really? Oh, dickheads. Teach you to shoot me, I'll shoot back. Sons of bitches. He hit hard. Alright. While that's reloading, I'm gonna go refill my glass. I'll be right back. Eat some honeycomb, huh? This is almost dead. Better get up here. Have you gone completely mental? You ignore my orders, go off on a suicide mission, and instead of donning a breastplate, you dash into battle, shirt open, navel and whatnot exposed. <laughs> You're not my father, Roach. You've no right to tell me what to wear. But I am your commander, and you will obey me. Guerrilla warfare. Warfare! It involves armies, for fuck's sake. 
I could not abandon them. They helped us. It's a soldier's job to kill, Bess, not save, not rescue. If that is not to your liking, join the Sisters of Melitale. Study to be a healer. Fucking hell. Give me your weapon. You'll get it back when you wise up. If you wise up. Move out! <coughs> <coughs> Uh-oh. Got yourselves a prisoner. We don't take prisoners. You took my weapon, Roach. So I must manage with my bare hands. Leave him alone. There are corpses enough here. What? You heard me. I did, and I can't believe it. He came here to murder civilians. He's seen us. Will you have him return to his camp and report? Emir knows we can kill his men. Let him learn that we can also show mercy. Mm. Roach, noble of you and all, but occasionally I work for Nilfgaardians. Frankly, I don't want any trouble. I don't like this. But so be it. You certainly don't deserve to suffer as a result. Well said, Geralt. A good black one's a dead black one. I'll strangle the bugger. Stand aside. I'll do it. Nen, Trokai. Yep, that's uh, work for you. We should go before a patrol comes along. Thank you, Geralt. Ever need any help? You know where to find me. At least I got 50 experience for Alright. The volunteer. I guess I already did this one? Huh. Whoops. Guess I could have gone back to do that one at any time. And it's way down here by the orphans, okay? But I did see something here in town. That and we want to clean up our mess here. Oops. Found the fast travel marker. Fucking deer just run around. <sighs> Hear him. And there's the patrol right there, just whistling along, all these dead bodies sitting around. He's like, ah, screw it. Why can't I talk to this guy? Let's uh, rest till morning. Now I can talk to him. So, you want a pre med, or have you got a special order? Let's do, I'd like you to craft something for me. Let's just see what we got here. So we got boots. No.
garbage. <clears throat> Two oh eight. Oh yeah. Let's just uh, sell everything we can. Let's see what he's got to buy. <clears throat> or what to sell, anyway. Let's see if he's got anything good. Probably not, but... Hardened timber. Hardened leather. These are all lesser glyphs. Sweet lord. He's got some ingot. Damn, he's got all kinds of shit in here, huh? Seventy, all right, fifteen, fifty-four. Come over here and buy some more shit. I don't even know that I'm gonna use any of that stuff, but. Might as well pick it up, right? Which red things? You have to be a little bit more specific, dear. Oh, they probably were hearts, yes. Oh, these over here? It just means that I can't sell them. Unless you're talking about this stuff over here. Like this here is rubies. These are monster livers, monster hearts, monster ears, monster bones. So. Yep, no hard selling. God, that thing's ridiculous. I may have to hold on to that. Honestly, I don't know that it's going to be any better once I actually get to level 28 and can use it, but... Sell that shit. Alright. Let's see. Crafting. Repair. 
This is what I should have done. Damn it. Hey, Beck. Hey, Gary Bear. How you doing, buddy? Doing pretty good. Good. Uh, how was your vacation, buddy? Oh, it was awesome. It was incredible. Had a great time. Excellent. Did not want to come home. <laughs> I can understand that, yeah. Yep, yeah, I was like, fuck, I don't want to get on this plane. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sure the Witcher gear is better, or might be better, Belt Girl. So, how have you been? Oh, not bad. I've been busy as hell, but, yeah. Busy as hell's good, you know? Busy's better than bored. Right, right. But, I've been busy enough that I haven't really been able to enjoy, like, playing video games or anything. Oh, alright, yeah. See, that's too damn busy right there. When's your uh, beta session? Uh, twenty third. I did not get. I yeah. I did not get the. Uh, well, I guess a week and a half. All right. Yeah, because today's the twelfth. So. But yeah, I did not get the um, the stress test. Uh, Xbox Insider, probably because I did not order off of the Xbox or from the Microsoft store. I ordered from uh, uh, GameStop. So, hey, Nick. Uh, yeah. I, I just now. Um, so long. Mine. Okay. Yeah, and they, they sent me my confirmation that I did get the beta, but they told me later. Right. Which I'm sure is the the basic line that they give everybody. Nice. Yeah. Now, hell, I I went and played uh, played some poker and uh, pretty much paid for my entire trip. <laughs> so. See, that's always a good deal. Yeah, made. About nine hundred and fifty bucks in about ten hours. So, excellent. See now, if I could just do that day in, day out, right? You know, five days a week. Hell, I mean, I wouldn't mind playing forty hours of poker a week yeah. if I knew I could make that kind of money. <laughs> You know, and there were several regulars there at the casino that that is what they did. You know? Oh, nice. Worker pleasure. Nice. It's always pleasure in Vegas. Even when it's worth. <laughs> So did you make any money? What, what happened? Yeah, yeah. Witcher. Well, Great hits. For... I want my coin. Where is it? There. Take it. Twice the sum as agreed. I keep my word. Sure. Oh, nice. Second time around. Never mind. Thank you and farewell. Nice. Yeah, I learned a long time ago. Uh, don't play any game in a casino where the house has an interest in whether you win or lose. The atmosphere. I love. Yeah. The atmosphere is such a party. 
Yeah. And that's, that's the best part is, like, you're just there and everybody, you know, for the most part, everybody's wanting, you know, whoever's rolling to win. In fact, if you're really wanting to roll, you just keep rolling. Right. You don't, you know, don't lose. You know, and then if you can do that, then people are just happy to help yeah, I've made a little bit of money at craps, but again, I was playing it because there were eight of us, you know, at the table, so. Right, yeah. It's no fun if there's only a couple of people there. The Kenny Rogers game? Uh, do I play stud poker? No, I play Texas Hold'em No Limit. But what's funny that you mentioned Kenny Rogers, Phoenix, because Kenny Rogers, I was playing at an Indian casino out there on a reservation and a lot of the in California a lot of the Indian reservations partnered with like Marriott or you know uh, Harrah's or something like that to uh, to get their their casino up and running well the casino I was playing at actually partnered with what? Kenny Down. Rogers yeah and he's like the official spokesperson and stuff like that he does all their commercials it's pretty funny Six pack is one of my favorite Kenny Rogers films. Now I just played some one two uh, no limit Texas. Ah, uh, okay. Cap army! No cross, no boat steel! Redanian army? Oh, yeah. Where are you hiding them? In, in here! Me! No see mans? <laughs> Join me! King Ravodid army! Or the god, god boats is. Hmm. Boats are in pretty bad shape. Me! God boats, let's say, but no wood for to make a fence. Their boats, I, so me, fence, make a boat. Boats, God boats. Got it. Why'd you join the army? Someone recruit you? Good? No good. Come good soldier man. <laughs> say chargy man, what's boats? Peasanters, they steers. Peasanters, boats. That's literal, la, la, la. <coughs> I think I do. Redanian seized some peasants' boats. Thought the peasants might try to take them back. What happened next? Chargy men go. Soldier men drink and sing. Not sing. I think he needs to see a dentist, Listen, though. Try. Get that girl Both. work done. Come, peasanters, swing sharpie sticks. I help what army. Runner to runner. Holla, peasanters. Holla, soldier mans. Gentle. Move them apart. But all lie down, soldier mans do. But order had me watch boats. And what I? <laughs> Trollalolo soldier man now. Trollalolo just sing too. You for sing you? No thanks. Heard you earlier. But listen, where are the bodies? Don't see any. Hungry go. <laughs> Should no waste. Peasant as good food. Soldier man friends. Not so good big stew. Always good. <laughs> nice. Perfect. Guess I understand. Wartime rules. Man's soldier man too? 
no. Tra la la la. Makes man soldier man. Tra la. Charging man. Say, green paint. And man, breathe paint. Uh, paint? What are we talking <laughs> about? Paint! Paint! Red colory? White colory? City gods? No city gods. Trollolo. What's boat? Trollolo. <laughs> Lipstick for trolls. Nice. Fine. I'll try to find some paint for you. Good mans! Redaini army. No service forget. And and <laughs> That's incredibly disturbing, Denise. <laughs> All right, so now we got to come over here and get the paints for Trollolo. Trollolo. Yummy. Yeah. So I'm going to watch Venom tomorrow. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I totally forgot that it was coming out this weekend, too. Doors hardly ever go in. Not once come out. Nasty bones. How you doing, brother? Your kind spreads disease. Defeat is I go to the movies as often as I can. Go on, don't think twice, just buy. This merchant. Taking a peek at my way. What can I do with you for? If I ain't got it today, say the word, I'll have it tomorrow. Let me see. Might pick something. Ah, there's our paints. Yeah, he ain't got nothing else, but we may be able to sell a few things to him. Snake figurine. Oh, nice. We get to see old Dino, huh? I gotta catch up on a bunch of stuff. I gotta watch freaking Vault Girl's podcast from last week. Oh, it was wonderful. Vault Girl tore it up. I'm sure she did. I'm just bummed that I missed it. Yeah, I tried to sneak into Bones' stream every so often, but... Lately, I mean, I haven't even been home to watch anybody stream. It's pretty good. Yeah, pretty I, ridiculous. I hear you. Oh, well, girl, you did a, a wonderful job in, job in the stream. Which is pretty good, considering, like, you've never done the stream, and you had only done the one video and all that kind of stuff, so you jumped over that hurdle pretty quick. Fell asleep. This is the second stream that Denise has slept through in yeah. a row. Yeah, I would not doubt that. Fell asleep. <laughs> Gotta love that, Dean. Hey, I'm Braden's. I'm Braden's. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Hope all is well. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> yeah, that's why I'm fixing to do a clean wipe, Dean. All characters, all mods, all everything. Be doing that here pretty soon. So long. May do it this weekend. These will take forever to download everything again. Yep. Choked to death on three pounds of steel. Deformed penises. Ooh. I'm so Right into the trash. I'm, I'm telling you, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wipe out my cloud saves. I'm, I'm cleaning it all out. It's the only way to make sure that, uh, that it is totally clean. I had someone ask me, uh, well, it's a comment on one of my videos if I was still gonna be doing Fallout 4 builds, and I said, oh yeah. They'll be doing for. I like the mask. It's cool. And it matches his amulet. Private Snake, report on order. Just so happens I have some paint on me. Oh! 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 Uh oh. What's the matter? Has paid, but how? Don't know. Hmm, might be a problem. Man's how no. I order. Man's knows. I guess I do. Depends what. Birdo cutlery. Redania Birdo. Shields like. Guess I can give it a shot. Got a brush? <laughs> yeah, great. Where's that guy? Beautiful. Pretty bird, Think so? As long as you're happy with it. <laughs> man's good. No, like other man's take juice. I like him. Ooh, an enhanced griffin armor. Nice. I am loving it, Dean. I... I'm really looking forward to, to stretch the legs on this system. So, um, so yeah, so it's going to be a lot of fun. I will be buying uh, Fallout 76 for PC as well. So I have Fallout 4 for PC and Xbox, and I will be doing the same for Fallout 76. So yeah, it'll be um, it'll be fun. the The problem is, is I don't know how to play Fallout Four on PC <laughs> at all. I mean, I can run, shoot, and pick shit up, but building, oh my god, I don't know how Gary does it. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm gonna have to. Exactly. Yeah, die constantly tells me I shouldn't get a controller because building is simple, um, but decorating is a bitch without a controller because you're using the A W S D right to move back and forth, and it's not and very fine. There's no fine movement whatsoever. You get 
nice playing moving with, with your mouse, you know, moving side to side and up and down or whatever. But no, no, no fine movement. And you only have two speeds: run or walk. Right. <laughs> I guess three if you're doing sprint. Yeah, it's just weird because you know I'm used to playing a PC game. Your 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 left hand is you know over ASWD, and your right hand is on your mouse. Yep. But then you have to like let go of the mouse to press the enter key because that's like in fucking imperative for building mode. You know? Nah, you press E. Oh, is it E? All right. Yeah, E, e does your, your building stuff. So, okay. Yeah. Well, guys, we're getting this thing cleared up. Talk to Tris about the statue. Well, T not for building, T for other controls. Yeah, you couldn't hear me because I had my headphones pulled off. My wife was yelling at me for something. Yeah, and I had the output volume of Discord turned down a little bit too. So. Ah, yeah, see, that'll do it too. So I had to get up and adjust my my speaker so that it still wasn't like too crazy loud. Yeah. Because they still have not fixed Streamlabs OBS to uh, to do the monitored output. So I can't like I can't hear. To, to hear the game, I have to use a set of speakers plugged into my monitor that's getting a feed from the Elgato. But that speaker is what I normally use to hear all the the audio coming out of Streamlabs. Uh, okay. And so everything's just kind of cattywampus, but it's working. Hey, Naomi, welcome back. All right, so now we're heading up to here, and we need to... Fast travel. Of course. Naomi don't even like me. She didn't say thank you to me. <laughs> so what did I do to you, Naomi? Huh? Just kidding. She wants to be on your next podcast. Ah. See? You know, we're we're getting you... quite the backlog. I think Liz is going to be on there. Nice. Um, we're going to have more PSGI on there. Um, uh, Mikey wanted me to move it up and do it. All right, Dean, have a great night, buddy. Talk to you later, Dean. And he's another one you should have on your podcast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we, we, we are working our way around, that's for sure. Like, have to yelling to through the wall up. in the restroom across the hall. Oh, I see why. Yes. Let's try. All right, say something. Something. There we go. Now they can hear you just fine. Really? Yeah. Oh. 
before you were apparently Sweet. in the in the bathroom across the hall from me. Oh, oh. Well, that sucks. Yeah. Well, and speaking of that, I think I uh, need to before we talk to Tris and I think I need to take a quick break here. I've been sitting in this chair for 2 hours and 40 minutes pretty much. So Yeah. I will be right back. Definitely break time. But hey, Gary Bear's here to entertain everybody, so I'll let That's him right. entertain you. Be prepared to be entertained. <laughs> All right, I'll be right back, guys. Sweet. So I'll be right back too. I'm not sure who I'm going to yet. I'm just saying. Can't a man love two women? Especially two beautiful, hot women. Just saying. <laughs> and this is Geralt we're talking about. 
Welcome he's back. I'm a, back. A, welcome back yourself. Oh, yeah. thank you. He's a huge man. I am not. Look what I picked up. Artifact compression. Someone got themselves enchanted in this figurine. Intend to decompress? Of course. Whoever cast the spell on the poor soul must have forgotten about him. Thank you, thank you. Looks like a nobleman. Could be just that. Come with me. I can't perform the ritual here. I mean, he has history with both of them. Just saying. Everything's ready. Let's get to work. Thank you, Naomi. Know, well, Denise, my vote is Let's for try. whoever I think it's a noble is the most fun. Be on your guard. It could be something far more. Looks on everything. <laughs> right? That is always the excuse, um Braden's. In Alan Dwan Ar Ice. No, Carl, no! I, I can explain everything! <coughs> Carl? I never looked at the last. You are my one and only. Interesting. Oh, oh, you're not Carl. Some succubus. Hey, uh, easy now. Delusion. Where, where, where am I? So Coral enchanted him, just like her. If there's a more vindictive sorceress, I don't know her. Well, except maybe... Coral's not here? In that case, come to me, succubus. <laughs> What is your name? Hmm? We're in Novigrad. Novigrad. In Novigrad? Last I recall, I was in Oxenfurt, and Coral was furious. How can she demand fidelity when she herself is wanton as... as... As youthful goats. <laughs> exactly. Damn it! I feel as if I've been trampled by a herd of cattle. I have no notion what yes, you did he to did. me. But it seems you've delivered me from my misfortune. Here, take this. Have a good time. Paint the town coral. Whose taste has grown worse since you were sleeping with her. Come on, the kind-hearted gentleman will get along fine on his own. All right. God, I wish you could clear some of this shit out. No, it is usually not kind. It's a temptress. I guess we'll check out this message from an old friend to see where that takes us. That I had found that book. Did I not find that book? Apparently I did not.
What's he doing here? I did not. The treatment of her uncles through cauterization, the study. Oh, I wouldn't go f that far either, Gary. Come on now. <clears throat> Everyone's seen a boil usually more than they'd care to. These deformities don't just mar your beauty. They can be signs of disease or even the disease's cause and epicenter. <clears throat> if your lungs wheeze and your heart flutters, or if you're just sick of pustules, you can carve them off. And wow, did Denise write this book? <laughs> <laughs> and be free of this ill for good. When you go to carve off a boil, use a sharp knife which you've had a dog lick thoroughly beforehand. For a dog's tongue works wonders in healing wounds. You've got to be wow. brave as you go about it, slicing as confidently and steadily as if carving off a hunk of cheese. Then quickly cauterize the rustlant wound using a red-hot poker. Don't pay any mind to screams or tears. Pus, bile, and any other humors need to be gathered in a basin then dumped in a pit in the pit covered, else the illness might return. I'm hungry now. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> My manifesto must be it. There's a letter inside. The reasons for choosing Jacques D. Aldersberg as Grand Master remain a mystery. The Order of the White Rose has gone through a crisis in those times. It was on the verge of collapse. Some might guess that the Brethren wished to have someone decisive as their leaders, someone with a clear vision. De Alderberg was precisely such a man. One of his first decisions was to change the Brotherhood's name to the Order of the Flaming Rose. That's actually a pretty cool name. The most puzzling aspect, however, is that the Order and the King himself decided to trust a man who, for all intents and purposes, had appeared out of nowhere. They say he was a wanderer and an uh, itinerant priest who moved crowds with his speeches declaiming non-humans. They say he worked miracles and showed his flock visions of a world destroyed by the White Frost. He was undoubtedly a man of great charisma, one instilled with unshakable principles, which he in turn tried to instill in others. Was he truly a source? Was he indeed gifted with raw magic talent? That we will never know for certain. Read the letter. All right. Witcher. In the ocean of possibility, some events are more likely and some less. It's not easy to fish out the first, not even when one's intellect stretches through all time and space. I left this letter for you in the hope that despite all odds, you will come across it one day, for I must warn you, mankind is threatened. The prophecy's destruction by the White Frost is not just the babbling of some mad she-elf. Perhaps I will have the opportunity to convince you of this in person. If not, I must rely on this letter, which you will read many years from now at a time when you know more than you did when we first met. Well, I certainly hope so. Know that nothing will save the world except preparing its entire population for this catastrophe. The old tales of a child of the elder blood can stave off the danger, but I tried and failed. Ever since, I have been haunted by a hideous vision, a crowned wraith, the specter of my failure. I was the chosen one, and the chosen one failed. You and your brotherhood are our only hope. When the time of the wolf's blizzard comes, men shall perish, and only the ubermen will survive. Your duty is to give the world ubermen. Whatever you think of me, do not fail as I have failed. A. Alright, look it up. Tell us, Denise.
I'm not going to read through these books. I mean, not read, read through the books. Do what I mean. Alright, so. We got the book out of the way. We got some crowns. Let's see what else we got. Secondary quest. Gwent, Gwent. Following the thread. Gwent races. No. Fake papers. No. Alright. Let's put that away. <laughs> the White Lady. Dictionary definition. I copied and pasted it. A demon in female form said to have sexual intercourse with men in their sleep. It sounds hot. <laughs> See what I did there? Come on, Gary. Sounds fine to me. I don't see what right. the problem is. I mean, you don't have to wait until I'm asleep. Right? <laughs> I'll pretend if you need me to, but hey, whatever. No, you can't rape the willing, Denise. This is true. It said, said to have sexual intercourse with men in their sleep. Not raping. Not raping. All right, so we're going to do this contract, an elusive thief. And it's 12.36 in the morning. Not during daytime. How you go with this evening? You know Sarah from the county. She's definitely a demon. Double shades. Um. Generally speaking. Permission is implied. Okay. Unless unless the the safe word has been used. That's right. And now I know you're asking, well, what's the safe word? We have to establish that. So mm -hmm. again, go see rule number one. It's implied. Calling Flower. Cauliflower, that is a good safe word. Use it in a sentence. No, not me. Buying or not, I'd not buy that for half the price. Ah! <laughs> It's quite the hat there, Sylvester. Greetings, Master. Hear about the contract. Really got an imp problem? Or is that just an imp perfection in the nose? Oh. You ought not jest, Master Witcher. I know the creatures are only to exist in fairy tales, yet I saw one with my own eyes as it stole from my stall. What did it swipe from you? Once it was bread, uh, then a fish, then apples. I do believe you are right. But added together and the business suffers. And I'm hardly alone in being pestered. It's nicked something from every stand in the square. All right, so what's this imp look like? Like a mean, fat cat, but a very large one. Uh, this tall, see? And it walked upon its hind paws. So, will you teach it a lesson with your silver sword? Make it worth my while and I will. Demand for witches is high, supplies low. I pick and choose my contracts these days. 
Ooh, 243 to 340. I guess we'll start at about 290. A bit much, but a compromise is in sight. Only slight annoyance level. So let's go down to uh, 282. A bit much, but a compromise is in sight. Okay, 275. A bit much, but a compromise is in sight. 268. Got Fine it. negotiation on your part, Master. So be it. We'll call it agreed. Relax. I'll help you. Small businesses are the foundation of a healthy economy. And so on and so on. <laughs> Thank you, Master Witcher. I don't know if this will be of use, but most recently the thief leapt over that wall and ran into a passageway. It was the last I saw of him and a few of my wares. Got this cracking in my spine. Merchant was right. Actually does look like a giant cat. Did it go from here? Double shades. Looks like the imp dropped some loot. Another track. Some bitch ran across the wall, across the ceiling. Drop down into the moat. Trail ends here. Put on boots? Paw prints end here. Boot prints start there. Could it be the puss in boots? Doors wide open. Interesting. Educated. Johnny, please cut out this nonsense at once. This might come to you as a surprise, but a giant cat will tend to stick in people's memory. Why don't you pick some other safer form like I did? I've been walking around as a beggar for three years now, and no one's batted an eye. So, and such earnings. You wouldn't need to steal anymore, so how will it be? If you decide on it, I'll put in a word for you with the King of Beggars. Till our next writing. Lewis. P.S. Burn this letter once you've read it, alright? P.P.S. Yes, yes, I know. I'm paranoid, but humor me and burn it. P.P.P.S. If you find this letter next time I come see you, you owe me a beer. I know. <laughs> the Doppler. Explains a lot. And complicates matters. Need a good lead to track him down. Yes, I too want that uh, that lovely large icon. No, it's a uh, pretty pretty good. Hell, I've left it on for days. Of course they're possessed. You possess them. Right. 
They didn't walk into your house on their own. Could use a pint of lager. Whoa! And there he is. Shady individual. If anything happened to you, we'd go hungry. Rare sight. An elf and a guard of the eternal fire having a friendly chat. Friendly? Nothing further from the truth. This racist here has demanded to search me for no reason at all. Use a non-human, I need no other reason. Lucky I didn't find anything well, on there's you. an option, Piss maybe it's still an update. Don't play your flute. Hmm. That was some pretty bad acting. Really ought to explore other career options. Petty theft, maybe. You dare insult an officer on duty? Let me give you some advice, mutant. Look who's talking. I know you're a Doppler and a clever. Cheetahs player. never win. Merchants put out a contract on me. Winners never cheetah. <sighs> Always the same old shit. Hey, wait. Why are you leering at my elder, eh? Oh! Really? There. Really want to see an angry witcher. Do you? Damn, I look old. <laughs> Stop, I surrender. You better do something. That dude's kicking your butt. Might be able to look like a witcher, but that won't make you fight like one. You're donning your skins enough to know what kind of man you are, what you feel. Red stuff on the ground, that is my witcher senses. It allows me to see things like paw prints, boot prints, stuff like that when I'm doing tracking. Hmm. A favor. A favor from a Dobler. Yeah, exactly, Denise. What favor could we possibly ask of a Dobler? I'll spare you, but you gotta help me in return. I need you to assume someone's form, Caleb Mengas. I need you to sail the Temple Isle and... What? I'll not do it. I'd never do it. You might as well kill me now. Same that the torture Menga would put me through. Fine. Never mind. Just stop stealing, or I'll torture you myself. Now get lost. Well, that's a bummer. Oh, there's another quest over here, though. Die for what you've done. I've done nothing. G gentlemen, I beg you. What's this about? This Dwan sold Fistech to some young elves. A contaminated batch that killed every other user. Lies. They mean to kill me, steal my gold. Help me, please. What you sold was poison. Shame you weren't there to see the young lad and others expire amidst spasms. <clears throat> You, all of you, to an elf. You despise humans, seek vengeance on us. But can you fault us? Fault me for your civilization's downfall? Shut your mouth, Poisoner. Need to see if this man's actually carrying any fist tag. We've done that already. Checked everywhere, even his boots. Nothing. The bastard sold it all, which hardly makes him innocent. 
All these damn choices. Just the sale of Fistek is bad enough, but offering contaminated powder, it's malicious. Something that has to carry punishment. No! Don't let them murder me! You can't! Thank you, Vatgern, for letting us do what was only right. Vafeo. Don't know if that was the right move or not. But... Ooh. It is what it is, I suppose. That is the age-old question, isn't it? All needs of the mini and all that. Enough. Leave him alone. Oi, you a non-humanophile, is that it? If there's one thing I hate, it's to repeat myself. Leave him be. Hey, lads! Got one eager for a lick in here. Let's show him what happens to freak lovers in Novigrad. These people are really stupid. Thank you, Vatgern. If you hadn't intervened, they'd have snipped my ears like they did Phalar's. Or worse. I'd leave Novigrad if I were you. How about that? Non-humans bother you as well? Me? No. The Eternal Fire, yes. They've got other scapegoats to burn right now, but it won't be long before they come for you. I don't believe they will. They'd not dare go that far. I was in Rivia in 1268, during the massacre. Know exactly what I'm talking about. Take care of yourselves now. Meaning? What would you have me do? Never leave my home? Step off the pavement to let a human pass? Farewell. Uh, and it's also the, the mob mentality, too, on Bradens. They think, oh, there's three of them and only one of me. Yeah, let me know how that worked out for you. They ought to never let your kind in. Master. Problem solved. Convince the imp to go back to the countryside to tangle horse manes and piss in milk, as tradition ordains. <laughs> and how would I know you speak the truth? No trophy, no reward. There better be one, or you'll feel the invisible hand of the market smack you so hard you won't be able to sit down for a week. <laughs> I'll give you half the agreed sum, no more. And I'll not do business with you again. Now pissing in milk. Pissing in milk. There it is. That sounds yummy. Oh yeah. Alright, 
let's see here. Talk to the guard. Oh, he's right over there. Good folk! <clears throat> Mages have set the hunter's house aflame! Yeah, I've been playing with mods on Fallout 4 for so long I almost forgot what achievements were. Help! Save me! <laughs> I'm here about the contract. Oh, well. A night patrol got massacred. Tough men, the lot. Armed to the teeth. A beast must be. Must? What makes you say that? If you've seen the corpses. What did the corpses look like? I've not seen anything like it in my life. And I've seen a lot of corpses. Hey, boo -boo. Ever heard talk of folk who died in the deserts of Zeracania? From the heat alone? These corpses came straight out of those tales. Let's talk about my pay first. I know what my services are worth. Well, that's better, but still too much. Really? All right. I believe I can pay you that. Provided, of course, that you do well. Bodies buried yet? Where? Orders were to burn them. Our medic was to take a look first. Talk to him. He's at the docks now. See what I can do. We'll pay you. The boys and me, we pulled what we had for a reward. All right. To the docks we go. There are a shit ton of shady individuals walking around. Hey, you! Yes, you! You got water on the fray! Ah! <laughs> a witcher? Oh, hear about the notice by chance? Not quite, but what's it about? I hear right, you're going on some voyage, need a companion. Not just some voyage, cross the sea. Mark this, when I got pressed into the infantry in 1242, I promised my beloved letter I'd return alive, whole, and with a pearl from Skellige. Not just any pearl either, a black one, the rarest and most precious. Well, exactly, well, I'm ambitious. Perhaps. But they were empty words. I came from the war, that one and the next, but I never fulfilled my promise. High time to change that. Or if not now, then when? Thing is, I've grown old in the meantime, as you see. <clears throat> Can't manage it alone, need a strong shoulder to lean on. Which are shoulders as strong as they come. So, what do you say? Plan's crazier than it is sane, but there's an irresistible charm to it. Offer me some pay and I'll help you out. Don't you fret about coin. I brought home a good deal of it from various fronts. Say we meet in Skellige, by the collapsed bridge near Arenbjorn. It's but a hop away from the bed where black pearls are born. Will that work for you? Sounds fine. See you there. Nice. And we're off again. <clears throat> Prepare for battle. You shall not have it easy this time. Broad friends. Huh. They all pledge to defend Maid Bilberry's honor too. No. 
No, no, they defend justice. For it is only fair you face a threesome. <laughs> is that so? Yes, for you are a rogue and a cheat, sir. You never revealed yourself to be a witcher. Yep, fuck it. You never asked. But since you've all gone to the trouble, let's fight. <laughs> You still hear the kids scream? Yeah, we're not reading that crap. All right. Yeah, I killed him. That guy's just a seaman, and he walks really funny. He got the hell of a strut going, don't he? <laughs> yeah, I know how to do some sales and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> You're the medic. What can I help you with? I'm looking into the dead guards. Heard you did autopsies. Did their friends hire you? Good. I'm happy to help. Heard the bodies were desiccated. Do you believe a beast killed them? I don't. The bodies were dried out. But perhaps they tried to apprehend a mage who cast a nasty spell on them. Was it dehydration? Strictly speaking, no. No, I don't quite know what to compare it to. Last body. Where was it found? In a side alley along the road from the docks to the brothel district. Someone had dropped it there in the middle of the night. Need to examine that spot. Find any claw or fang marks on the bodies? Fangs? No. Claws? Not quite. Only scratches. Fingernails, most likely. From their adventures with whores. Thanks. Should go see the place where they were found. Good luck. I think I'm gonna make a plague doctor mask. Just to have it. Maybe I'll make a leather one ah! and one of the other ones like from like the I don't know from like, Oh, I don't know, from like 16th, 17th century somewhere in there. Hey, you right. you know, right. Bodies were found here. Gotta look for clues. Anything unusual. Oh, my. What a freak. What'd you call me? A child's footprints. Damn, lots of foot traffic. Hoofprints, clearly. A horse? Hmm. No horse I know walks on two legs. Paul! <laughs> to crippled Kate's. I love how they're all just Longer labeled strumpet. You can see it in your face. Oh, there's Bertha.
Greetings. Oh, here it is. The apocalypse. A witch has walked into my brothel. What's strange about that? What's strange is you. Everyone knows witches are freaks, mutants, unnatural. And <laughs> this here is a decent brothel for whores with principles. <clears throat> well, spit whores it out. with principles. Got all the same bits in your trousers like a normal lad. Last I checked, everything was where it should be. Heard about the murders? Guardsmen? Many perish round here. It's the pleasure kills them. Tell the truth. The succubus. It draws customers. It's raised our taking something wonderful. I know it's a threat, but... I don't know that it kills. A succubus. Where'll I find it? I've placed it in a house nearby. Here's the key. And now we get to meet a succubus. We can go at it here, or at my place. You choose. That this is your place. Sleep, sleep, sleep. <sighs> and now she's probably falling asleep. She's not even paying attention. Yeah, there's some good stuff over here. Oh. And I find bread. Have you come to kill me? Dunno. Wanna talk first? Why'd you kill those guards? I was careless. Let them surprise me. They wished to kill me. I had to defend myself. That it? No heart-rending story about human hatred for all things different, all things strange? I'm not one to lie. Nor do I kill without reason. That's what I do. Gotta understand. I can't let it happen again. Yes. I saw murder in your eyes the moment you entered. Huh. 
Really? Nothing? That's a bunch of bullshit. It is the Witcher way. do that. Let's take a look at our 56 of 190. That's not too bad, but... Succubus. Succubus? Succubus? In Novigrad? How? Light of the eternal fire protects the city. Must have gone out a few times recently. <laughs> In any case, the succubus is dead. Here's proof. And here's your reward, as promised. Farewell. <laughs> All right. That's where we're going to wrap this. I mean, it's 11.10 and I'm, I'm exhausted. I'm still trying to catch up sleep because I did not sleep a lot on my trip. So, uh, I think that's where we're going to end tonight. Thank everybody for coming and hanging out. Good time as always. Well, and thanks I, for having us, Vic. Absolutely. And I'll be streaming again this weekend. I may stream tomorrow night. Sunday. Yeah. So, we'll, uh... Um, I don't have any kids. At least... Nope. Don't have any kids. Yeah, no. And uh, I want to thank you guys, as always, for coming and hanging out. And it's a great time. I love hanging out. I missed you guys. Uh, it was the one drawback of my vacation is that I couldn't hang out with you guys, but uh, for all of you that are on my Discord channel, um, I loved reading through the conversations and stuff like that, and all the little things while I was away. So, uh, yeah. Until next time, you take care of yourselves out there. This is Drake Invictus saying this has been the greatest day of my life. See ya!